welcome today we will learn how to use 991 year scientific calculator we will see different modes available in this calculator first of all press mode button you will observe the different modes computation mode complex statistics base mode equation mode matrix table and vector very first press 1 you will have the competition mode where you can observe D and it is math okay in which you can do the general computations again press mode button complex mode now here suppose I want to calculate this I will get through this okay again mode button now we'll see stat mode where it will ask for the equation or polynomial whether it is of linear type logarithmic exponential then power equation x raised to b or a b raised to x or 1 by x so let's take one uh, e example of linear a plus bx so for that we need to press 2 here it will ask for the values of x and y let's take some random values 2 3 6 5 press equal to side button go to at top position for y put the values of y okay press ac it will store the data now we want to calculate the summation so shift see the yellow color start shift one will gives you these options we'll go for sum which is available at four number now i want to get the sum of summation x so i'll press two press equal to you will get the answer press ac again shift one is used for statistics mode if i want to calculate coefficient of correlation that is available at three number press three give equal to you will get the answer of coefficient of correlation again if i want to calculate the coefficient so for that again go into the seven number regression and let's calculate the constant 0.3 which is the variable press ac shift one four number summation this much summations are available in the 9 one es calculator press ac now next mode is base mode if i want to convert to in the binary so i'll press equal then i'll press button binary so this is the conversion of two in the binary mode different modes are available where by pressing this we'll get the answer press ac mode button we'll see equation mode already you are knowing this uh, there are Two unknowns there are three unknowns it may be the quadratic equation it may be the cubic equation so depending on the case you will select the option now let's take one number for two unknowns LHS coefficients 2 3 for you for second equation let's take 6 3 2 and just press equal to you will get the answer for this simultaneous equation x equal to y will this now similarly mode button equation mode if i want to calculate quadratic equation i'll put the values only coefficients and the answer will be there okay press ac mode button now next mode is matrix mode how to use it it will ask for matrix let's take matrix a uh, now select the size whether it is 3 by 3 or 3 by 2 I'll select 3 by 3 matrix put the values of the elements of the matrix I am putting the random values for demonstration purpose after putting all values press AC shift 4 now I want to ins insert again one more matrix so I'll go for data now I'll put matrix B again it will be 3 by 3 put the elements
okay after this press ac so we have inserted two matrices matrices matrix a and matrix b so now to do the matrix operation shift 4 so now here you can see matrix a matrix b matrix c and determinant and transpose so if i want to multiply matrix a with matrix b i'll just put 3 then into again shift 4 now see matrix b is available at number 4 so i'll press 4 just press equal to it will give the multiplication of this two matrix now if i want to find inverse of matrix a so i'll go shift 4 3 number and just press the inverse button give equal to it will give you the inverse of this matrix okay if i want to calculate determinant shift 4 again 7 number determinant of what again shift 4 which matrix 3 matrix equal to it will, it will gives you determinant of matrix a similarly you can do it for matrix b okay then next mode is table mode which is very useful one you have to put the function and then you have to put the range and the width in between these two values so let's take one example that is sine alpha x so sine to x is the function press equal to i want to start from zero i want to end at 360 degree and the difference of angle is 30 degree you will get directly the table with all values up to the 360 degree with the equal interval of 30 so this is the use of this function uh, table mode we have to insert the polynomial then the starting point end point and the range or you can say difference between two consecutive values press ac next mode is vector mode 8 number again we have to define vector it is let's take of three elements the coefficients 3 2 1 ac similarly go for vector mode now i want to insert data vector b again it is of three coefficients okay now shift 5 vector a cross product vector b you will get the answer directly okay so this is the use of vector mode so now to clear this all modes shift 9 3 equal to press ac so the mode will be by default computation mode okay now we'll see how to find out integration of any function using this calculator so here you can find the integration button press this insert the function let's take sine to x bracket complete side button now it is asking for the limit let's take 0 to 2 pi before doing that change the mode shift mode you should be at radian mode whenever you are doing trigonometric operation so now just press equal to you will get the answer so this will be the answer you see again this button is used for numerator and denominator 3 side button 5 and this s2 is decimal ac if i want to insert 3 ra square if i want to insert 3 cube so yellow color is used by the shift button and red color can be used by the pressing alpha button so in, one more thing if i want to find out any equation value of x for that i will use shift calculate and just press equal to i will get the final answer it may take some time already we have taken random question if it is uh, not saying that it is saying that can't solve then you will again insert the different equation so you got the answer for this so just insert the equation available as it is in the screen and then press shift calculate and press equal to press ac now if i am having the decimal number 
and I uh, into 10 raised to 3 sorry minus 3 10 raised to minus 6 so if this number I want to get in 0 0.000 format so I'll press engineering button shift engineering shift engineering so it will convert it in 0 0.00002999 into 10 raised to 0 so this can be used for getting the numbers uh, which is having 10 raised to minus power you see again if you want to find out permutation and combination these two buttons can be used by using shift so permutation 3p3 equal to you will get the answer similar thing for ncr3 shift ncr3 c3 so that is 1 press ac then if i want to use hyperbolic function i'll use hyperbolic sign there will be option sin h of 3 you will get the answer Uh, ln is log to the base e and log is the log to the base 10 if i want to find out factorial 3 shaped x inverse it will 3 factorial it will gives you answer okay then shift mode it is used for changing the degree to radian likewise now one more thing if i forget to insert any number in between then i'll use replay button and shift insert i want to insert 3 over here 3 into so that can be solved you see then rectangular form and polar form that can be used uh, then degree to radian conversion can be taken from this okay one more last thing is remaining if i want to make a table of different functions at a time so for that let's take one example i am having the theta that is equal to x sin x cos x sin x into cos x sin square x likewise so i will take one simple example then it will be clear see that whether your function is at regular mode so shift 9 3 equal to ac so i'll put alpha x double dot that is colon which is avail available at the top of integration button x sin x colon cos x so this colon divides table columns of the table okay cos x and I want to calculate it just press calculate button it will ask for the value of x let's take it at 30 it will gives you values okay now again it will ask for next row so you need not to insert equation again and again only one time you need to insert now this time I want to insert x as a 90 so 90 equal to you will get the answer so depending on the table make the functions available with the separation by using alpha double dot that is alpha integration you will get the answer so this is very useful for making different tables so these are some basic tricks basic functions available in this scientific calculator it will be very beneficial to you and use the calculator smartly thank you shift ac it will off the switch off the calculator.